Hello, welcome back to another Software Developer Profile Review. My name's David, I'm a software developer with over 20 years of experience. I've also managed international recruitment teams. In this series, I want to show you what, de what developers see? No, what recruiters see, why they might be overlooking your profile, why you might be getting rejected or accepted. And I did a video recently where I actually compared a bunch of profiles together. So pretending um, or simulating that you'd all applied for the same job and I'm the recruiter looking through. And I think giving it that real world context seemed to resonate well. So I'm going to do that again today. We're going to look at a front end React role. So everyone on this, when they sent me their profile review request, either stated they were front end or full stack and mentioned React. Um, so we'll get on with that. If you would like a profile review, please visit crushing.digital and click this button that says profile review. There is a bit of a queue, but I'll get to you as soon as possible. If you want to ask me a question, which I answer in another series on YouTube, there'll be links somewhere um, for the other the other playlist. So all the questions that I answer for developers. If you would like me to help you by marketing your profile, you can uh, um, join this star developers. These are all the developers that you know, want me to push out their profile to employers and my network. Um, if I like your profile, um, I mark it as a star and uh, it's approved. Um, but I'm quite picky. Um, if you want to know how and why I might be approving your profile, you can either do the course or you can just follow my content. I teach it all for free anyway. Um, Obviously, you've got to collate it all together. That's the only issue. If you're a coding boot camp and then you would like me to help your students to stand out, please come along to the Christian Digital website. Click on For Teachers and here's the service. Uh, there is a free trial um, so you can try out the service. You get everything from, you know, as it says here, LinkedIn, GitHub, portfolio, resume reviews. I teach them about networking, job search. We do one-to-ones, you get unlimited uh, profile reviews and more. Anyway, let's get on with this review. So we're looking for a front-end React developer. And I'm kind of going to work on the tab order and go through all these and try to put them in who I want to interview first. Maybe I'll put them towards the left-hand side. So let's begin. And I'm going to be pretty quick. So first developer, Raphael. Yep, says React, I'm in the right place. Front end, React, oh, has AWS. That's nice. Uh, maybe that was in my um, nice to have uh, list. Get down to here. Front end developer based here, proficient in agile. Okay, got other skills as well, but definitely focused on the front end stuff with AWS. I can get to GitHub. Um, so I'll have a quick look at that. Talking about React. There's a resume there as well. Uh, so if we look down here, okay, you've got about a year of experience. I don't know what you did for four months of it. Here, can I see React as Redux? So I'm kind of assuming, but would would a recruiter be able to assume that? Probably not. So uh, at this point, I'm a little bit nervous about it. So. Uh, this is where I was viewing GitHub, unless this is going to drastically swing it. Here, I'm I'm on the fence. Um, I'm not seeing React, 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 React. Where, where am I? Front end. At the minute, I'm unsure. I think there might be good skills there, but you're making me work too hard. So not stand out at this stage, but let's carry on. So front end web developer, Svelte. Now, like I said, everyone here had mentioned React. Um, so now I'm thinking, well, do you want to do Svelte or do you want to do React? I don't know. What are you talking about? Can't tell from this at the minute here. What have we got? I'm not seeing React much. Doesn't even mention it in the top skills. Is it anywhere down here? Not that I can see so far. So it's Angular and Svelte currently. Svelte before that. So you seem to move on from React towards Svelte. And I think that's where you're going. So at the minute, I'm going to favor Raphael because I think if I jump onto a call with you, you're going to tell me you prefer uh, Svelte. In which case, that's going to be 
um, time wasted in an interview if I don't think you want to do this as a job uh, or you're not living and breathing it. So uh, it's in the right order for now. Alexandra, don't know what you do yet. JavaScript, you're doing what? Where can I see evidence of it? We've got a GitHub, so we'll open that. What are you talking about? Hacktober, Agile, I still don't know. So React, okay, we're talking about React. Boom, front end, React and view. Do you want to, which one do you want to do? I'm not sure, React and view. So what are you currently doing in your experience? JavaScript, uh, React, so we've got three months there. And an internship, what were we doing on here? Was it all vanilla JS? It seems to be, but I'm open to hiring a, a junior. So show me you living and breathing it. Don't know what you do here. JavaScript developer, okay. Okay, so it's React or Vue based off that. But what have you been doing in React? I don't know currently. So lots of activity. I think I'm gonna place you above here, but we're certainly not um, knocking Raphael out at this stage. So let's keep going. Peter. Okay, we've got full stack here. So we've got React. We've got React. Boom. Do you want to do React or do you want to do, do you want, are you bothered about it being full stack or not? My first Tailwind project developed a React app. Okay, great. So it's full stack here. I'm a bit nervous that maybe you want to do full stack, but there's definitely some React experience with it being freelance. Now I'm wondering what did you build here? So we need to know exactly what the projects were. Um, this is all 100 days of code stuff. So I don't know what you did on this experience. Um, so we've got portfolios. Maybe this is going to drive it home. Let's see what you've been doing. So this is React, Node, Node. So at the minute, it's more full stack. So how do you describe yourself up here? Mern stack. It's a bit crazy in terms of the design here. So at the minute, I think you're going to stay where you are as well. Mm. I can at least see you, but I mean, at this stage, I'd, I'd probably leave you where you are because this person has um, good experience elsewhere. So I might be willing if I if I can't find any more to dig into are you sure you're okay going back to react Kareem so this will be a, a a difficult one don't know what you do I don't know what you do uh, the featured section I don't know what that is I'm not gonna click on it the there's no f activity so you're brand new you went to North coders which is cool so there's some React on on that, but what have you done with it since? So I can't see any activity. Show me some GitHub or something. Nothing. So this is one of those classics, Kareem, where I'm like, there's no way I can actually dig deeper to find out more. There's nothing to show me what you can do. This is a personal website. Software engineer based in Manchester. What do you do? So I still don't know what you do. A few technologies I've been working with. So React was last. At the minute, it's a no. Uh, I just don't see enough drive to be um, doing this, to, to be learning this. In fact, I will try and be a bit more optimistic. I saw GitHub. So if I can see you living and breathing React here, we might save the day. You don't tell me what you do. Personal website, I don't know what that is because I'm a recruiter. I'm not going to dig into like a package JSON or anything like that. That's it's a, some TypeScript, but I don't know whether it's React or what. So at the minute, um, that's a no. Sean, what do you do? Don't know, don't know. I mean, you've applied for this React job, so I'm hoping to see you talking about it somewhere. No, we don't talk about it. So again, from a boot camp, did you mention it here? Didn't mention it above the fold. So senior engineer. See, see, engineer doing what? Um, so I don't know what that is. Where's, what can I see? There's nowhere for me to go. 
So I think we have to leave that there because there's no way for me to dig deeper. Can't even see React anywhere on here. So that's a no. Felipe, come on, Felipe, save the day. Um, the lovely mountain. Uh, software engineer, GraphQL, that could might have been one of the extras on there. TypeScript, boom, JavaScript, React. Great, we're in the right place. Um, software engineer, three plus years of experience. TypeScript, JavaScript, React. GraphQL, loving it. I even want to read more. Definitely talks about GraphQL a lot. Boom. Resume, tech talk. Tell me you're giving the tech talk. That would be nice, wouldn't it? If you're giving the tech talk on GraphQL. Felipe's giving the tech talk. Felipe, you're, you're going up the ranking here. And what is this? Managing complex schemas. I'm guessing this is not you. Ah, oh, co-authored by... F living and breathing it at the minute i'm liking felipe i mean he's got experience anyway but you can see how there's evidence already and i'm not trying to filter on the amount of experience i'm saying i'll i'll take anyone along with the living and breathing it it's like react boom was it react here i wish it pulled the tech out of here react boom react react yes felipe all day long uh, and this has got nothing to do with the, the amount of experience. This is the fact that Felipe lives and breathes it. So next one, React. I've got React here. Front end. Okay, boom, liking it. Power to do what? But we've got React next. Awesome. Thank you for thank you for sharing these insightful thoughts. Oh, it's, you're commenting on, a, on somebody else's. Okay, so here on your job what did you do it's freelance which makes me nervous what what did you build router built on top of stuff it's clearly got experience but i'd have to dig into it to work out how valuable was that year and a half let's go and look at supporting information we've got a github always like it when i find a github tell me you live and breathe it here python python css 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 doesn't scream so there was good ex there was good experience i'm going to move you up because it's a maybe but i don't think you topple any of these people at the minute uh so next one software developer sean have i done sean before yes we've done sean Next one, full stack software engineer Tavon, full stack, doing what? So JavaScript, React, Ruby, C Sharp. Okay, do you, do you really want to do this React role that I've got? Um, passionate, experienced software engineer of the years, I've been doing blah, blah, blah. Show me the React stuff. Can't see it. Certificate of completion to you are you are you moving towards C sharp because that's what you're learning right now. It's all come from a Microsoft background, C sharp. So you did it on you, at Flatiron, you did that, but uh, you did React there, but then it's been C sharp all the way since. I'd like to see some kind of expression from you that you definitely want to do React. An Airbnb clone, GitHub. So it made me work hard to get to GitHub. Show me that you love React. Show me. No React. Not much passion. Doesn't mention it here. I'm going to leave it there, I'm afraid, because uh, you're not displacing anybody else at this stage. Um, I would say you move up probably up uh, here. And then last profile I've got is... Malaku, front end developer, front end React, boom, liking it. We've got a GitHub. So I've got more to look at. Finished a front end coding challenge, Tailwind. Okay, vanilla JS. Show me what you're doing with React. One year experience front end React and Python. Okay, but it's, you're definitely mentioning React. Uh, comes from a DevOps background. 
a full stack developer so I'm still nervous about that but let's go and look at the github do you live and breathe it no very little TypeScript C TypeScript Python JavaScript at the minute no you're not living and breathing it so maybe you move up a little bit because you showed me something but at the minute Felipe and Raphael wins and that's how quickly I would organize it now what's happened here is some of these people may have lots of experience they may have um, lots of evidence somewhere but I couldn't find it quickly so now you're going to be reliant on Felipe failing the interview Joseph failing the interview or no Joseph Raphael failing the interview everyone all the way through failing all of these interviews before I'm going to get down to these people and when you think about it I'm only showing you 10 profiles here if we made this much bigger and there were thousands of people if you know you're applying on LinkedIn that's what's happening is I'm very quickly finding four or five people who uh, make it much easier for me it's much clearer much more concise in the message that they live and breathe this or they want to do this that that's who I interview first and and that's why these people will be being rejected eventually if I make sure that all these people pass their interviews so I hope that's been insightful I hope it uh, gives you an indication of um, how you should do this and, and how you should present yourselves and why you might be getting rejected like I say if you would like a profile review head over to crushing.digital if you like this video please like and share and subscribe and all that stuff and I'll see you next time Take it easy.